Yeah. I talk about this in the very beginning of the book. Humans have been eating meat for the entirety of our evolution as hominids, and we can get into this in a moment. Many anthropologists, many scientists that I looked at, that I read, that I talked to, believe that the human brain exploded in size, not literally, but figuratively, about two million years ago because we began eating meat at that time. There's mm. evidence for hunting practices, uh, these Odual, these uh, Acheulean tools, so these bifacial tools that kind of look like stone knives, mm. evidence for butchering and hunting. It all happens about 1.8 to 2 million years ago with the arisal, with the, um, with the appearance of Homo erectus. And then suddenly, if we look at the cranial vault size, brains get bigger. Mm. And they just kept getting bigger and bigger and bigger over the next 2 million years. They went from 500 cc to 1500 cc. The point that I advance in the book, the thesis, is that eating meat made us human. Mm. Why would something that has been a central part of our evolution be bad for us? That's just sort of the intuitive perspective, right? Yeah. And then when we look at interventional studies, we don't see that either. So there are studies that I talk about in the book where people were... Uh, they replaced carbohydrates in the diet of any source with eight ounces of meat. So they ate less carbohydrates. These could be things like vegetables or bread or pasta. And they added eight ounces of meat. So half a pound of meat. And they looked later on, uh, weeks later, to see inflammatory markers, immunologic markers, DNA damage. All of them went down. They all went wow. down. So how do we reconcile this, right? When the epidemiology studies, like the one from JAMA, say you're going to eat more meat, the, that's correlated with more cardiovascular disease. But the interventional studies say meat doesn't harm you. In fact, it looks like it's good for you. Hmm. And we know intuitively that makes a lot of sense because we've been eating meat throughout our evolution. It's incredibly nutrient rich and we can talk about that as well.